Invoicing is a central part of any business operation as it represents the efforts you've made to complete and fulfill orders. Therefore, this feature also has its valid place in PyRefusion. You can create invoices based on sales orders, job orders, memo sales, or you can simply pick an item from your inventory and invoice it. When you create an invoice, you can add multiple orders as well, thus aggregating different orders under a single invoice. Let's dive into details. As with most of the processes in PyRefusion, invoice creation can be automated, but there is an option for creating them manually. When we create an invoice manually, we must select the mandatory fields like the customer, the invoice date, or payment term. After saving the invoice header, we can start adding the desired orders or items. Like I said before, we can add job orders, sales orders, inventory items, memo items here. Let me add some job orders to this invoice. We can scan the job order envelopes or select the job manually from the list. Here we go. We can see the item details. We can apply a discount before issuing the invoice if we want. Taxes can be added to the invoice automatically. If you need a more sophisticated tax calculation, we recommend the TaxJar app, which PyRefusion is integrated with. On the other tabs here, we can see the job infos, customer payments, and credits if there are any. We can choose the Add Payment option to record a transaction. The three main action buttons I would like to highlight here are Print, Email, and Shipping options. As their name says, you can print the invoice, email it to the customer, or you can start the shipping process by creating a shipping label for your orders. At the time of recording, PyRefusion offers integration with FedEx, Parcel Pro, and UPS. QuickBooks is one of the most common accounting systems for small and medium-sized businesses. Our integration with QuickBooks Online will automatically map to QuickBooks everything that is necessary to replicate the invoice. This mapping includes customer mapping, item and item category mapping, invoice and transaction mapping, plus customer credit mapping. This plugin is ideal for those who issue many invoices daily the time-saving benefits by eliminating double data entry will be huge. Find out more about this plugin by asking one of our sales representatives. One-click invoicing or automated invoicing is something every company desires. I will show you how you can do that in PyroFusion. First, let's start with invoicing job orders. On the job order list, we can simply push the invoice button and the system will create an invoice based on the actual job order. If there are other open invoices for the same customer, the system will prompt you if you would like to issue a single invoice instead. We can also link the invoice generation to one of the workflow steps. This could be an invoicing service or any other service where you want to trigger the invoice generation. Creating an invoice based on a sales order item is just as easy. We navigate to sales order items tab, select the item, enter the number of items we would like to invoice and hit invoice. The invoice is now created. Invoicing sold memo items is also easy. We go to the Outgoing Consignments tab, select the items we wish to invoice, and generate the invoice.
While some users decide to use special shipping platforms for shipping management, if you are using the standard FedEx, Parcel Pro, or UPS services, and you have an account with these providers, then why not bring everything under one roof? We can start the shipping label creation from the invoice section, or we can create a shipping label first and then start assigning invoices. By changing the status to ship package, we can start the shipping rate calculation and the shipping label generation. PyroFusion will pull the tracking number as well once the shipping document is generated.